Okay, so another fun one. Today, um, I'm going to do a little twist on it. I was sent some Turkish munchies um, from our friends, the Noragers. Thank you very much, guys. And um, I'm going to try these first. And then I'm going to try some stuff with it that hopefully tastes good. Um, but is a little odd, hopefully, maybe, kind of, sort of. Anywho, so, all right. So I have already looked through this. They look really good. Um, I have uh, the description of the things here because some of them don't really have like a description on, or they do, sorry. They do have the description on it, but I can't read the language. So yeah, so these pizza crackers, that's easy to read, right? So I think these are gonna be good. I'm not a fan of pizza. Um, cause I played soccer growing up and so it was basically pizza parties every weekend for about 10 plus years cause it was my brother playing soccer too. Um, so I kind of don't like pizza anymore. Um, on the rare occasion I'll eat it, but let's try. Hmm. That was really good. So let me find it on here. So the pizza crackers, that's all it says is pizza shaped crackers. They're really good. Okay, so I'm gonna try these with a raspberry. Because I think that a raspberry would be really good with it. So let me get out a cracker. And I need to eat more fruits. You know, fruits are healthy for you. Mmm. That was a nice contrast because you get a little bit of the, like the pizza flavor, like the tomato -iness with the raspberry. Okay. I will keep those for later because I'm going to munch on them later. Um, let's do the nine cat tat. I'm guessing it's banana flavored. So it says banana cream filled wafers with natural and artificial flavors. I hope this would be so good with the raspberries too, but I love wafers. Not a big banana fan. I like, oh, these are cut up in little pieces. That's so cute, see? Like they just come off in little pieces. Okay. Mmm, mm -hmm. Definitely banana flavor. Mmm, that's actually really good. So I am gonna try this with the raspberry. Mmm. Mmm, that was really good. The one thing I really love is peanut butter and banana sandwiches. So I got some peanut butter. So let's let's try this out. I think it'll be good. Mmm. That is really good. Oh my gosh. Okay, I don't want to get too full. I will be eating that later. I was really, okay, let me get some water. Like my cup, it's a cow cup. I think it's utterly adorable. Okay, so the next one, let's do the snowball. So it's, where is the snowball on here? Is it not on here? Snowball with coffee. Oh, coffee and coconut. I don't see it on here though. I could be wrong. Mm. Oh, because it's not on here. It has a different thing on here. That's okay. That's fine. This looks delicious to me. It has coffee in it, even though I've already had a cup this morning. Oh, this looks so good. Oh, this is going to be so good with the raspberry. Ooh. And I got some else I could try it with. Okay. So let me flip this over. Let me get a knife and cut it. Let's see. Oh, it looks like there's ground coffee on top, too. Interesting. Okay. 
So, mmm, mmm, that is really good. You can really taste the coffee in it, actually. Let's try it with the raspberry. Mm hmm. Mm. Mm hmm. Mm. Oh my gosh, that was so good. So the next thing I'm gonna try this with, I'm just gonna try a little piece because I don't want to get too full. But I really want to try it with whipped cream cheese. Because whipped cream cheese kind of acts like an icing, basically. And even though there's plenty of icing on here, just want to try. Because I'm hoping it cuts down the coffee flavor. Because I usually have a lot of creamer in my coffee, so. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Oh my god, that's delicious. I'm going to have so many snacks to try later. That was good. Mm. Okay, I'm gonna have to get out some plastic baggies because there's no way I'm gonna eat all this today. Um, okay, so the next one, let's do this cool thing. So, this is the Cocomel Pofty. It's a marshmallow ball with natural and artificial strawberry flavor. Interesting. Oh, there. And I love that they put the expiration date in a format where Americans can read it. Because <laughs> it, they, it, they explain it. They say about expiration dates because in other parts of the world they do um, date and then month and then year. Whereas in America we do month, date, and then year. So glad. I mean, with obvious ones, like if it says 27, 5, and then the year, okay, that we can kind of figure out easily. But when it says 5, 4, or 4, 5, it's like, uh, which one is it? Anyhow, okay, so let's do, let's get a new knife. I don't want to cross-contaminate the coffee with the strawberry. Okay, so, oh, this is a straight-up marshmallow. Oh, hell yeah. Ooh, I crumbled the cookie and that's the way the cookie crumbles okay so let me put that off to the side this is what it looks like on the inside so I think this is gonna be really good with the raspberry I'm excited mm. it's good it has good flavor but the crack the cracker portion is kind of dry so, I'm going to add a raspberry. If I can. Mm. Mm hmm That is really good. Okay. I need more room. Okay. All this stuff is good. It's just water in my cup. Okay, so the next one, mm, I don't this is a cat, 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 which has hazelnut cream filled puff pastry with natural and artificial flavors. So I'm gonna try this. I might be allergic to hazelnut, I don't know. We'll find out. <laughs> it's not a bad allergic reaction, so I'm not like concerned about it. I should have got, like, a plate out. This looks so cool, though. Oh, some of the pastry got stuck in the thing. That's okay. So I'm just going to... This would be really good with the raspberry, too. Mmm! Mmm! Kind of dry. Not a lot of hazelnut filling. It's good, though, once you get the... He's in that filling. I'm not out of raspberry. Yeah, 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 uh huh. Mmm. 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 
Mm. Mm -hmm. okay. It's crummy. No, it's delicious. I just don't want to get too full. Um, the raspberry was excellent. Oh my goodness. That was really good. We need some creatures here. We can't have this stuff, Bubba. Okay. Um. Hmm. I might have dropped crumbs. Okay, let's do a lot of this has hazelnut in it. Ooh, these. These are, they're called Super Old. They have, they're wafers filled with cocoa and hazelnut cream. It's like those, I don't remember what they're called. I don't remember what they're called, but yeah, these are good. I love these. I'm sure they're, they're the same. Mm. The pyrolines, that's what they are. These are gonna be really good with raspberries too. Mm-hmm. And I like that it's not as dry as that pastry. It's really good. It's like me, a redhead. <laughs> mm. So good. Okay. Let's try it with cream cheese. I've never tried them with cream cheese. Mmm. That is really good as well. Mmm. All these are so good. I'm in trouble. I'm starting to get full. Okay. I need to make more room here. Okay. Next. Another wafer with hazelnut. <laughs> so this is a coconut cream filled cocoa wafer with natural and artificial flavors. So not really a fan of coconut unless it's in like a, a mound or an almond joy. Like I don't like the, oh these are cut already, it's too awesome. Um, which we'll call it, like the coconut flakes. I don't like those, but I like um, macaroons. And I like coconut cookies. There, there was this one cookie at my, one of my old, oh, it's breaking. Oh, is it supposed to be like that? I think it's supposed to be like that, okay. I thought it was supposed to be like this, but it's not, it's supposed to be like this. But, anyhow. Mmm. Mmm. Can't even taste the coconut. And if you do, it's light. Anyhow. Mm. That's good. Okay. I'm gonna have a lot of snacks to eat later. These are caramel. Okay. So, known fact about me. A little known. Well, I don't like caramel. I do not like it whatsoever. I have never liked it. Growing up, whenever I saw somebody eat it, I would instantly get nauseous. I, um, yeah, I don't like it. Um, I will eat the do -si dos the Samoa cookies, um, from Girl Scouts. That is, like, the only way I will eat caramel. Um, except for caramel apples. I'll eat caramel apples. I don't know why. But, like, other, like, Snickers, all that will not touch them. I cannot, no. Luckily, I don't get nauseous when I see people eat it anymore. So this one's going to be interesting to eat. I'm trying not to psych myself out. Okay, so. Da, 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 da. Chocolate coated caramel biscuit with natural and artificial flavors. Here goes nothing. Mm -mm. I can't do it. Excuse me. I can't do the caramel. I don't know why. I'm sure it's just a mental thing at this point, but I can't. I don't, I don't, I don't like it. So, my husband wants that when he can have it. Okay. Hi, buddy. Um, this has chocolate in it. Oh, I can give you a pizza cracker. Excuse me while I get in there. You want a pizza cracker? Here you go. He likes them. 
Um, okay, so the next one is Abdolu. Um, yeah, I can't even pronounce that. Where is it on here? Um, mama, mama. Oh, here it is. So it's a hazelnut cream filled wafer with peanut pieces. Ooh. So peanuts aren't my favorite nut. I like walnuts. I like cashews. I love almonds. I love macadamia nuts. Peanuts are okay. I like them. I'm just so you know. I love candied pecans with my cheese boards. Those are really good. Ooh, these are square. Okay. So let us try. Mm. It's okay. Can't really. I don't feel like the. I know the peanuts are in there. I can taste the peanuts. Sounds. Hmm. I'll try it with the raspberry. Because. These all have been really good with raspberries. A lot better with the raspberry. I have one more to go. Oh, two more to try. Mm -hmm. So, oh, these look like regular pretzels. These are, they're not even on here. Oh yeah, they are. They're salty stick crackers. So these are like regular pretzels. So I'm not gonna try these because I'm pretty sure they're gonna be delicious, you know? But these, crispy tacos, where are they? On here, they're crispy baharat. Um, so I'm wondering if they have baharat seasoning. It says spicy stick crackers with natural and artificial flavors. So baharat seasoning is something that is a uh, awesome seasoning. Like we use it all the time. Um, Hubby's from Iraq, so he likes a lot of flavor. And that's one thing they do very well is flavor their food. It's always delicious. So I'm excited to try those. Wait. And I want to try these. They don't look like they have much flavor on them, though. Yeah, they're kind of plain. They're basically like little mini breadsticks. They have flavor. It'd be really good with the cheese board. <clears throat> Let's see. That was really good with the cheese. Okay. It was good with the raspberry at first. Then I think the raspberry was too bitter. So let me try it again with a smaller raspberry. Oh, that's a smaller stick. Let me try it with a bigger stick and a smaller raspberry. I'll just try it with a couple of different sticks. I'm trying to keep it PG here. Okay. And. And. Okay.
Mm -hmm. So yeah, it was just that raspberry that I got that was back because that was really good. So overall, my favorite, honestly, surprisingly, was the banana one. And especially with the banana with peanut butter. And then I have to say the coffee cake one um, with the raspberry. Those were all really good. I'm like, So I'm going to have to like put them in the black bags and eat them over the next couple days. But they were really good. I'm going to finish the bananas right now. So, all right. <laughs> have a good weekend.